Hey everybody, Joel Lance here. Today we're in Phoenix, Arizona, like northern Phoenix, Arizona, outside Aoli Burger. Yes, Aoli Burger. Here to do their triple threat challenge. So this is a burger challenge consisting of one of their triple burgers, big triple burgers. Um, you have to pick one of their signature burgers. So like they have the aioli, which is what I picked, which had, you know, lettuce, tomato, onions, uh, bacon, cheese, etc. They also had ones with like truffle aioli on it. Um, they had uh, some Italianos. They had a whole bunch of different kinds of burgers. Then you have a big serving of their loaded fries. You got to go with golden, which are a white potato fry or a sweet potato fry, which the loaded fries are a big tray of fries loaded with beer cheese, um, avocados, uh, I think like additional chipotle aioli, just a whole bunch of different things. And then you pick a signature milkshake. Um, they have like, again, a set menu of milkshakes plus a rotating item. So I will like look at the different milkshakes and go from there. And so in order to actually get the challenge for free, you do have to beat one of the record times for the patties. So like, for example, the current record for three patties is about five and a half minutes. Um, so again, that's what we will try to beat today. But you know, then they have a record for four patties, five patties. No one's done more than five. So I mean, I mean, honestly, even at like six patties, it's not a giant challenge, just a short 15 minute time limit. So that's what we're going to try to do today. Beat the five minutes, 30 seconds for the record, just to get the meal for free. But pretty much that's about that guys. So it looks really good, it sounds delicious. Again, 15 minutes to complete this challenge. Um, and then if not, I believe the meal is about $30, $30, something like that. So we head on in, have some fun, eat some food. And if you win, you also get a t-shirt, which is pretty cool. So let's go have some fun, eat some food. And for these burgers are very, very good. So let's go find out. So here we are with the challenge. So here we have the aioli burger, the signature burger. Um, so yeah, like you said, bacon, tomato, aiolis, uh, cheese, all that good stuff. Big triple patty burger. I then have a side of the loaded sweet potato, so I'm a sweet potato, so avocado, chipotle aioli, also their pub cheese, which is made with a local beer and lots of bacon on that, and then the house-made pickled onions. And then I went with the signature milkshake, which is a banana cream pie. Yes, banana cream milkshake. So 15 minutes, guys. Uh, that's about it. Pretty much, we'll get started here momentarily. It looks really good. Apparently, these are very, very delicious burgers, and I believe it. So let's get started just momentarily. Very delicious looking burger. Big thing of fries. Um, we'll probably start with the burger, and then we'll move to the shake. But at that, let's have some ketchup, of course, gotta have some ketchup. How about we get started? Let's say the count of five, four, woo. That is a very, very big burger, actually, very big burger. How about we say three, two, one, let us go. Good luck. Very tasty. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're here at Oli Burger in Northern Phoenix, Arizona. Yes, Northern Phoenix, Arizona, here taking on their Triple Threat Challenge. So, um, kind of interesting and cool challenge. So they have like the base Triple Threat, which is this challenge we have in front of us, which features a three patty burger, the loaded fries, and a milkshake. 15 minute time limit but then you can also do like a four patty a five patty and hypothetically you could do an even more patty they don't have like a cap on the amount of patties but only people have attempted the or at least completed the three four and five patty version they have the same time limit so it's still 15 minutes they still have the loaded fry with them they still have the milkshake so again here we were doing the three patty uh, just for the sake of time and if we wanted to get the meal for free we had to beat the previous record which was five minutes and 35 seconds um, so the burger was absolutely delicious they were known here for their like flavorful delicious burgers and I really will say I absolutely agree the burger flavor was fantastic um, all the different like sauces and just it was great fantastic Get 
very cheesy. The loaded fries here are actually pretty dang substantial, a lot more substantial than I originally thought kind of looking at them, as it's not a very wide diameter tray, but definitely pretty thick, especially when you throw on like all the beer cheese and every, everything else. Um, but if you like kind of like that cheesy fry, loaded fries, I think you would enjoy it. I myself am much more of a burger guy than a fry guy. Um, and then, uh, yes, like I said, we did have the milkshake. I went with the seasonal one, the banana cream, um, which if I get to it, I will be able to touch on there. Again, really only a very short time limit for this uh, challenge being you know like five minutes and 35 seconds if we wanted to get it for free otherwise technically we would have beat it in 15 um, but we wouldn't have got the meal for free so you know I don't know to some people they might consider that a win you know and it is what it is nor nonetheless like I said we were going for that five minute and 35 second um, food was good um, what I will say though guys like I said this is the three patty version no one's ever done a six patty version let me know in a comment down below if I should go back and try to do one of their four or five or six patty versions of this challenge it's a pretty straightforward challenge so I'll let you get to the rest of it um, hopefully we will be able to complete it if you like the video so far please hit that like button guys um, always subscribing and commenting helps the video out as well but let's Tune in, let's see what happens. We only have about a minute and a half left to get the meal for free, so let's see if we can do it. 355 in. Very delicious burger. Very cheesy fries. That's it. And we're done. Now four minutes, 29 seconds. Very. And a new record at that for the three patty burger. This is a record for the three patty, the four patty, the five patty. Guys, that was a very, very delicious burger. Milkshake had real banana in it. That was definitely the flavor. A um, little, little messy. I had to go a little messy just to kind of eat that quickly. But I will say, very delicious. Aioli definitely had some really, really good burgers. I actually got the white truffle aioli on my aioli burger. The aioli is the kind, and it was fantastic. Love the aioli. Um, the milkshake, again, was really, really good. <clears throat> Excuse me, this was a, a signature here. Um, that, like, a, like a temporary signature, it's a shake of the month. But yeah, guys, for that, we do get a meal for free, which is pretty cool. We do get a sweet t-shirt as well. Very delicious, though, guys. Uh, like I said, very, very good burger. I eat a lot of burgers, and I would say that was a very, very good one. So if you're ever in the Phoenix area, I know they have three locations plus food trucks. Uh, so check them on out, guys. Aioli, um, the chef himself, was even on a TV show called Chopped. So that's about that. Hope you liked that video. And uh, I'm going to go probably wash this hand up. But that, guys, that's about it. Let me know down below what you think. What is your favorite burger toppings, guys, if you had to pick one? Honestly, mine's ketchup. What can I say? And actually, this is their uh, house ketchup, which they make here. Apparently, it's a little spicy. It's a little, ooh, nice flavors though. I didn't even have to use it. Everything was very, very moist. And I see we do have our t-shirt right here. I won't touch with my with my greasy hands, but do you want to hold it right here? It says, I conquered the holy triple threat challenge. Beautiful. I will say, it looks a little looks a little big for me. Only a 2XL. Not, not quite that big, guys. Like I said, thank you again. Hope you that video, enjoyed that video, and uh, hopefully have a few more views of Phoenix to come your way. Oh, and of course, guys, just I love you. Stay up, you're happy evening. Have a lovely day. I think I already said that, and if not, there I did. And that's about it, guys. So, like I said, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. All right, everyone. We're in Arizona. Arizona, Phoenix, Arizona. This is what the highway looks like, the 51 South. But this is what I love, guys. It reminds me of Nevada. We just have like these like desert mountains kind of here. And the uh, on the fore, the forefront, the foreground, like there's a big one right there. Just really cool. I again, I mean, obviously that is the blinding, blinding, blinding sun. But you can see all the rocks, all the desert looking rocks. And there you go, here's that mountain again behind the, the sun, or uh, in front of the sun, I guess I should say, which is gorgeous. 
I absolutely love, 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 love the look of this. Like, again, it's just something that I'm so estranged to. It's so foreign to me, you know, to have big freaking mountains of, you know, basically desert looking mountain rocks just everywhere. So that's something I appreciate. I think you always appreciate what you're not used to, what you're not familiar with. And that is definitely something I am not familiar with. Look at that. That looks so cool to me. Like, I mean, Arizona. We're in the freaking desert, y'all. So cool. All the snowbirds are back everywhere I've been. People say it's like super busy all of a sudden. But, uh, man, I love it. I really like it. Uh, I really, really like it. So, there's some views of Arizona. Obviously, I'm not gonna get to see like too much of the wildlife um, or the wilderness, because I'm kind of in Phoenix, the city, but nonetheless, it's what it looks like on the highway. So, good stuff. All right, and we are downtown Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, this is Roosevelt, Roosevelt. Uh, this apparently is like kind of an artsy area. Um, we ju uh, just drove by a whole bunch of graffiti. There's a gentleman uh, in the process of doing a piece of work as we speak. Um, so I'm basically, I just have a couple minutes before I need to uh, go do a challenge. So I just figured, this is like what somebody said, this Roosevelt's kind of art district. This is, now this is the area where Google brought me. I'm kind of surprised, I don't wanna say surprised, but anyway, that was where it brought me. But I feel like it is kind of the other direction. So I think I'm gonna make a turn, a U-turn. Let's get on out this way. But we get to enjoy some sights of downtown Phoenix, Arizona. Let's see, does this go through? Yeah, this goes through. Um, but yeah, so, I mean, there's some artwork technically on the wall. I'll uh, pull up here, you guys can see. Got some sunflowers. Alone in the wind, pretty cool, pretty cool. And uh, like I said, this will bring it back onto Roosevelt. Um, Phoenix is a cool looking little city. When I say little, it's not little, it's actually the sixth largest city in America with the uh, Phoenix and area. I think, I think it's what they refer to as the Valley, if I'm not mistaken, um, constituting almost seven million people. So it is pretty large, to say the least. Um, let's crank on back down this way. The person's like me doing some turns, except mine was a little, a little smoother. But yeah, we'll head on back down this way. Or we're in Roosevelt now. Uh, I can't see that. We are taking Roosevelt, so maybe I'll keep going this way a little bit. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Let's see what we got to see. So we just drove by another huge graffiti piece. There's people taking some photos, some professional photos. They had some lighting and all this stuff. Um, Trap House Barbecue, that's interesting. Uh, look, there we go. Got some more art work right there. And uh, yeah, like I said, uh, kind of cool area. Again, somewhere there's more arts and stuff, but nonetheless, we will cut our little tour a little short. But nonetheless, Phoenix, the little bit I saw of you, you're a cool place. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.